What's up, everybody? We're back with some more Nova Drift. Yeah. And uh, this time I'm going to do a build that's a little different. I like different. And I can't promise that it's going to be terribly successful, but I'm going to try my best. It's going to be... Uh, I like the weird builds in this game. And this game has a lot of diversity. You could do a whole lot of different stuff. Oh man, they're just gonna give me oh, all kinds really, of really good stuff. So we're just gonna take all do, that. Do. Uh, I don't want any of that. I don't want any of those bodies. I don't hey, want any of those shields. shields. All right. All right, game. <laughs> uh, okay. Body Sentinel, which is the shield body, makes yep. shields good. Better shields. Uh, let's see. We'll need that eventually. Uh, we're not getting... The actual shield itself. I, I needed a particular shield. I just need... There it is. There it is. All right. Halo shield. Anything in my little circle gets burned, but it will harm my shield to do so. Yes, but it does a lot of damage. Like, things go in your shield and just die. No, I mean, that is the long-term solution, yes. All right, shield effect radius. We're going to increase the radius and the power of our shield. Yep. So then we're just going to give everybody a hug. Uh, I have uh, been internally, and by internally I mean in my own head because I've not told anyone, uh, I call this the Johnny Cash build. Ah, because it's a burning ring of fire. Because it is a burning ring of fire. And then uh, eventually, uh, it turns into uh, I hurt myself today. <laughs> I thought that was Rancor. <laughs> uh, well, no. the The end goal of this build will, will also have a significant amount of self hurting. Except it won't be me intentionally taking damage. It will be just me hurting myself <laughs> <laughs> constantly right. forever. But we'll get into that. Eventually. Yeah. Alrighty. Um, uh, we can get barrier now, I suppose, because it gets right into Omni Shield. And we want Omni Shield. Omni Shield is our our first goal. Because that makes you extra shieldy, and this build is literally 100% all about the shield. So, none of these are Omni Shield, but. Uh, we can get Radiant Shield, which will increase our circle. Yeah. Which is good, because we want to keep people in it. Especially guys like this, who love to not be in my circle. And then they try to kill me. There oh, you go. Oh, there goes your shield. That'll learn ya. So we're just gonna... Dodge that for a minute. Yeah, just for a second. Okay. Our Ring of Fire is back. That is the downside to this build, is that it relies so heavily on the shield that when the shield does crash, you're kind of... Well, we we have solutions for that, but we're too early to currently have them. But we're, we're going to build in, into contingencies. All right, Omni Shield. Plus 50 flat shield durability, plus 15% damage uh, shield damage resistance, plus 15% shield effect power... If your shield has started cooldown, further damage only incurs a partial cooldown reset instead of resetting it entirely. That's really good. But mine is 90% whole strength. That sounds really bad for a halo shield. So, this is where our life is at now. Um, yeah, we're going to want purge. Because I don't think corrosion works with this build because it says hits and we're not... Well, right now we're hitting things, but eventually we won't be. Oh, yeah. The Halo Shield just applies stacks of burning. It doesn't actually deal hits. Uh, I want both of these. So, uh, this one is uh, targets within the uh, my shield radius take plus 20% total damage. Modified by shield effect power. So, it's going to be a lot. And this one is just plus 20% burn damage, which is the damage we do. Uh, and uh, flat hull and shield durability recovered for each burning enemy. Minusing the weapon damage, but we're not going to be using our weapon yeah. eventually. I think the purification is better short is better is better yeah. short term. Like they're both good long term. Yeah, I'm going to have them both 
Eventually. Right. But purification helps you keep the Halo Shield up longer while also yeah. increasing its damage. So, there's a couple of key talents we're looking for. Here's one of them. Hidden Power. Enemies take 50, uh, plus 50% 50 total damage from all sources. Improves nearly all of your defensive capabilities. Removes all weapon and construct mods from the upgrade pool. And your weapon has no effect and you cannot create. So, we're throwing away our weapon to make our shield better. And yeah. to give us more defenses. This is going to help in the long term for several reasons. One, it's really good. And two, it's going to remove stuff from the, the upgrade path that we don't want anyway. Yeah. So it's going to make leveling up in the future easier. So now we are just a circle of death. Yes. And this guy with the reflective shield doesn't bother me because... Because you uh, don't do hits. Uh, yeah. And oh, now... Look at that sweet, beautiful, just purple... Ev everything we want is here. All right, so we're going to reduce our shield radius slightly to get plus 25% shield effect power and plus 5% shield durability. Yeah. It's just going to make us even more hurdy. You just you drive near people and they and they explode. Yes. And dead. <laughs> just so you just kind of give them give them the old drive by, and they go away. All right, weaponized shield. There so now go. we're gonna do twenty percent more damage. So like the amount of damage that we do, like it just there's so many modifiers that everything dies very quickly. Ah, second boss. So second boss, we just kind of hang out. Right next to him for a second. It's like, how's it going, buddy? Oh, we're going to get some extra MacGuffins just because it's a bonus. Oops. Yeah, it's fine. We're good. Everything's cool. And he's, yeah, dead. he's dead. All I had to do was park near him. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Okay. So, there's several ways we can go. We're probably going to want to get emergency shields, so let's start working towards that. Yep. Uh, yeah, we'll just... So look, we'll fire trail, even more fire. Yep. Which works for all of our burning stuff, works towards that. So that's just added side benefit. Anything that has a shield, we don't care. Yeah, because, again, you just you yeah. cut right through it. Anyone that lays mines, we don't care. Because those mines have no, t no defense. So, it's just a whole lot of no cares given. All right, emergency systems. Nice and safe. Shield breaks. We're cool. So, that's one of our contingencies. The emergency systems is very important on this because when when your shield breaks, you need you need yeah. all of the safety you can get because you have no hull. Correct. Who needs hull? Not you apparently. Ooh, that's not helping your shield come back. Your shield's gone. Yeah. Everything's fine. Don't you worry about it. Now we're going to get Aegis, which will give us damage resistance. And then we'll just play it a little safe for a second. Our shields come in. And then we're fine. And that guy ran into your, your deadly wake. It's deadly. Yeah. It's in the name. Yeah. <laughs> wake. <laughs> <laughs> Nailed it. <laughs> Alright, so we can, we've unlocked all the prerequisites to Sanctuary, and it sounds great. But Probably it's not. not. That red text, your shield only begins cooldown when it breaks. That will get you killed. That is just instantaneous death to our build. It's bad. It's real bad for this build. So we ain't taking it. Um, uh, we're going to get regeneration. Because we, it leads into shield regen, which is another thing we want for our build. Because yes. our build is just shields. All shields all the time. Pop. Pop. <laughs> fizz, fizz. Oh, what a relief it is. Oh, yeah. I also have that shield crash thing where if I hit something that's burning, I, like, expend all of its burningness in a giant blast wave of death. Bink. <laughs> <laughs> See? That's pretty strong, actually. I love those guys that charge at you, that it's just like, ha, ah, nope, then. <laughs> so, just burn them, burn them down. Um, let's see, we can get that. Uh, well, let's start working on our adaptive armor. <laughs> so, yes, yeah, so we just bump into things, we don't care. Anything that comes in our circle. 
needs to expire. Eh. Oop. Oh boy. Yeah, it's okay. We'll take it easy for a second. What is nice is you, you like the amount of uh, your shield broke. Uh, yeah. Oh. There you go. But he might. Eh. Oh, he got him. Yeah. <laughs> got him. Ah, uh, good times. <laughs> All right. Faster mm. shield cooldown, but less durability. Eh. Yeah, well, we're not getting that. <laughs> uh, we'll get channeling. We'll improve our armor stacks. Ar armor stacks, good. Yeah. I love just seeing snakes with the halo shield because they, they just... just... You slurp them up like spaghetti. Yeah. All right. Uh, let's re-roll some of these. All right, so I want both of these. Uh, rebuke is nice because... Uh, armor stacks attack enemies when you fire, so you lose your armor when you fire, but we don't fire. But it also gives 110% armor stack duration. Yeah. So we get the duration, and we never, never lose never it expected. via firing because we don't fire. So it's just, just better armor. Yep. So... Yeah, the main strategy with this is usually like for big things that don't die immediately, you just hang out behind them, and you slowly circle strafe. See, he's firing missiles out that side. You don't see the missiles; you just see the explosions of the missiles burning instantly. Yeah. And then you know, you find some asteroids, and then you just immediately explode them. All right, we're gonna get core, core shielding, shielding which so is. Good. Uh, increases the armor stack reduction, it just increases our hull strength and our shield strength. And it's just gonna make us even tankier. -er -er. These guys run in with the mines and we literally do nothing and they die. Yep. The toxic hug build. <laughs> Except it's not toxic, it's fire. Uh, it's they they, burn, they fell rings. into a burning ring of fire. That's true. Oh boy. Fine. See, this guy's gonna shoot missiles at me, but can do literally do nothing. nothing. Just gonna... Those missiles literally can't hurt you. Uh oh, okay. Uh, all right, all right. We'll get volatile shields if our shields do break. Eh. There's your hurt yourself today. Whoop. Whoop. <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> uh... <laughs> they really want you to take sanctuary. <laughs> Well, I'm not going to. We don't have regenerative shield yet, do we? Now we do. All right, regenerative shields. So now our shields will passively regenerate. Passively armor. regenerate, a fair amount. Just do do do. do. And then just continuously just running around at the speed of sound. I don't know, that, there's no real point of reference to know exactly how fast I'm going because we're in space. Could be. <laughs> also, that that's there's that spaghetti slurp. Just, yep. just, just. Shoop. Nom 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 nom. All right, so here's where we get dangerous. Oh, I hurt myself today. Oh. Dying star. Deal constant burn damage to enemies in a huge radius. Damage is increased proportionally to your proximity to enemies and you're missing hull strength and shield durability. So the more hurt we are, the more burn it does. Plus 30% burn duration, another plus 20% burn damage, but you constantly receive 10 burn damage per second. Can your shield handle it? Uh, yes. And also we have the, the hull shielding, so it's only 7.5 burn damage a second technically because we're going to take 25% less because of that talent. Yeah, true. Okay. Right. I'm always so, terrified of dying. So, yeah. Look. So even outside my circle, things will burn and die. Yes. But anything in your circle is going to burn so hard. Yeah. And the the more damaged I am, the more burn Dying Star is going to do. It's true. That said, if your shield breaks, how long is your hull going to last? A negative 12 seconds. Okay. Well, no, because I'll go into emergency systems. True. So... I, I might get... I, everybody gets one, maybe. Uh, Alright, so what am I... 
What am I looking for now? What am I missing? What do I need? Uh, um, we have all the shieldy talents, I think. Yeah. Um, I can get skirmish just to get uh, extra crash damage. Yeah, the the extra crash damage and the killing like bosses at fifteen percent. Yeah, that's always nice. So we'll we'll do that for now. Just like butter. Yes, ev everything dies. Oop. Everything burns. Including uh, us. These enemies are going out with a yang. <laughs> so I'm just going to let my, my shield recover just a little bit here. Yeah. You got to play maybe a hair more cautiously when you're a burning pile <laughs> of death. It, does it taste like burning? All right, fifteen percent. This is another one we're going to be looking for eventually. Enemies take more damage. Uh, take more total damage. The more damage you are up to plus fifty percent. Okay. That's so good. that's going to be one of the next ones we get. But a, fa a flat fifteen percent on bosses in particular is going to be quite useful. That's true. And you are. Hello, boss. As I say, you are right about wave eight eh. here. Yeah, and then he's going to do that, which is a, <laughs> it's a mistake on his part. He shouldn't have done that. <laughs> that hurt him so much more than it hurt you. It sure did. That was kind of funny. <laughs> so then we're just going to hang the shield out next to dead. him. There he goes. Although, once again, he looked like he was well under that 15% and then didn't die. Uh, it's 15%. It's sometimes hard to gauge. All right, so now yeah. the more hurt we get, the more hurt everyone gets. That oh, slow down. Just slow down every oh, all the burning so particles. So many particle effects gave you so much slowdown. <laughs> no, it was uh, it was for dramatic effect. Yeah. So like, look at all the pretty colors. The colors, do The colors. Oh, color blanket. It's like the second time we made that joke. Yeah. <laughs> Nobody remembers what that's even for. Uh, no, if you Popsicles! keep... Yeah, I was going to say, if you keep with the joke, everyone knows it's a Popsicles joke. Uh... So but we're just, it's worldly. It's true. So we just exist behind this guy for a while. He's just like, what are you, what are you doing behind me? Get, get out of there. He doesn't really seem to care. He does. It just takes some time because he's got a lot of health. Yeah, juggernauts. I just like that everyone bursts into flames <laughs> on the screen. Hi, fans. <laughs> Alrighty. Uh, enemies at full health take plus... This is worthless to us because... Yeah. Specifically, enemies at full health take plus 20% damage from weapon hits and crash damage. I don't do weapon hits, and I'll never hit an enemy at full health with crash damage because they are going to burn long before I can touch them. This is true. So this is worthless. <laughs> yeah, unfortunately. So, look, well, I'll, I'll do something for you. We'll get magnetism. Yeah. It's a nice and safe, easy pickup thing. Oh. All right, so all these guys burn. Whoa, burn. Bounced you around a little bit. Yeah. That's fine. God, your non-shield burn radius is enormous. And it also increases the less health I had, so when I was a little worse for wear there... Like, that guy comes on screen and he's already burning. Like... Yeah. You cover, like, half the screen. It tastes like burning. <laughs> at this point, your shield is yep. basically just a... Yeah, those guys are burning already. Wow, it's so good. Yeah. We are roving space arsonist. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so this one, eh, because, um, it's, I mean, we're not really worried about our, if we're down to our hull, we're screwed no matter what anyway. I feel like Last Stand isn't going to work because of Dying Star. I think Dying Star is just going to immediately end us twice. <laughs> yeah, probably. 
So, hmm, I'm gonna re-roll it, I guess. Um, uh, we'll, we'll, we'll get a little bit more hull strength, and then we'll get some of the, like, damage reduction-y stuff in this uh, path. It's a, it's a good thing that that goes into a decent path, because 20% hull strength on... Nothing. A 10% strength hull is just like, woo-hoo. Yeah. Look how big my red bar is. I was just saying, that's, that's, that red bar is with an extra 20%. That does not look like it moved. Yeah. Everything near us burned. That guy barely got on screen. He just showed up and popped. I, I, I hear things off screen dying. Occasionally, just random XP floats to me. I let him hit me because I knew I'd get a good purge bounce. Yep. Um, no, I don't want... I can get an additional 20% health strength. Yeah. <laughs> hmm. I mean, it does do extra crash damage and stuff. It's not the one I'm looking for, though. I'd rather have this one first. Uh, it does not reduce burn damage or self-inflicted damage. Shucks. But still. <laughs> yeah. I will say that the, the majority of damage that comes into me is from me. Yeah. That's why we're in the second... The second stage of our, our Johnny Cash build. <laughs> Whee! Whee. <laughs> uh, the more you hurt me, the more my burning star, dying star, my burning dying star. <laughs> and then just work with that for a minute. Watch out for, watch out for the energy lance. <laughs> All right, this is where things get a little interesting because these guys, shockingly, still suck. Yeah. Well, because those are also those would aren't, you stop yeah. with the level three bosses. Those, the worst part. Oh, your shields are real low. Yeah. The worst part is those. Ooh. What those? Oh, what those guys spit out are not real mines. Like they're mines in that they drop a thing and then they explode, but they're not mines, so you can't destroy them. Woo. Eh. Eh. Oh, is he going to singularity eh. this time? Nope. <laughs> Those little bumps do a lot of damage. I don't know if you're seeing the numbers. Oh, yeah. That's where you got to get that, cr that, hull, that crash resistance, man. Well, I mean, that's the next thing to get. I had to, un I had to unlock it. But here it is. Um, oh, well, this is... Uh, Crash knockback and crash knockback resistance. And, crash and hell damage resistance and yeah. crash damage explodes. So, yeah. That's fine. And we could do that. And do you want Juggernaut or Streamline? Uh, Neither, maybe. I no particular yeah. interest. Yeah, actually Streamline's not good for you at all. Yeah, Juggernaut can help a little, but... For, I think Force yeah, Armor. Yeah. For, Force Armor has no drawbacks whatsoever. It is purely just a beneficial thing. Uh, also, you are almost to Wave 100, and then we get to see how well this does. There it is. Hey, look, Wave 100. <laughs> you don't say. Uh, <laughs> there goes your shield. Yeah, it's uh, fine. We'll just do -si do for a minute. Let the shield come back. And eh, look at that, shield's back. Now we're just going to kind of chase him down for a minute as he tries to back away from us. <laughs> he's, he's like one of those cats that gets like a box stuck on its head. <laughs> yes. It just slowly backs away. <laughs> All right. Yeah. Hey, he's he just doing more damage to himself than yeah. he really is to me. He just got all that nice uh, hull crash resistance. Oh. Uh, it's fine. Yeah, these, these guys are going to uh, fire at me. I'll say this is a little slow at killing this guy, but... Oh, boy. Uh, it's fine. We're just going to play... Uh, it's like, I know it's fine. A little defense of me like first. It. Just a second. And boom, shield's back. Uh, I could probably just bop this guy and be done with him. Probably. 
Pop. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So yeah, Do, doing little little mini bops is mini bops. pretty good for damage. It's not bad. Mm bop a mini bop. <laughs> um, mm bop. All right, now we're gonna take it easy for a second. Yep. I hear things popping off <laughs> In the off distance. the screen somewhere. These little yellow bastards can't survive anywhere near me. <laughs> yep. What's more fun, we haven't seen them in a while, but what's more fun is the uh, the dudes that come out and they start spinning and just drop a million little dudes. Yes. Those little dudes don't. <laughs> they just don't. <laughs> <laughs> they just don't. Level up. So I'm running out of things that I want, James. <laughs> I pretty much have everything uh, I want. Gemini Protocol is terrible, I think. Yeah. Uh, I mean, I could just get Juggernaut. Yeah, it's it's not it's not it's gonna make huge, me a little but slower, but it's gonna make me beefier. Yeah. And I suppose that's fine. See, what uh what do you have to do to get the super mod where you uh unspent talent points <laughs> make you better? Uh I just have to stop taking talents. Which honestly might have been uh, this, like this a, a real thing. I mean, I'm t I'm too deep now. I'm not going to get that many more levels. But yeah. I think I think there was potentially a sweet spot where I could have just been like, you know what, I'm done with these talents. I feel I feel like that's something you'll have to test out for yourself. And uh... I have a crazy build that I haven't really played around with, but I kind of want to try it. Where you get the oh, there goes your shield. yeah, that's <laughs> fine. Oh, oh, it was it not fine. fine. It wasn't fine because more people showed up. I didn't expect the Juggernaut to die at that particular moment yeah, in time. The Juggernaut dying actually hurt you. He died, new wave happened, everyone showed up. Oh, look at all that XP floating out yeah, in space. It's, it's, I it's can't dumb. have it. I, I knew this was a riskier, weirder build. But, but all things considered, I mean, I beat the Celestial Boss dude. And yeah, so. you got past the 100. So I, I think there's potential there. Yeah, I think I think finding that sweet spot to to transition over to the uh, that super mod. Yeah, it's a thing. Could be could be real good for that one. Uh, so yeah, that, that did not make it to my top ten though. No, but Womp. still pretty good. But yeah, not bad. So uh, that was the the Johnny Cash build. <laughs> yep, you walked the line. <laughs> nice. <laughs> I appreciate it. So, uh... That's a pretty end screen with all those XP stars <laughs> running around. It's sad. That could have all been my XP. <laughs> uh, yeah, so yeah, next time we'll, uh, we'll think of another build and, uh, show it off. Yeah, and it'll be great. All right, see you next time. Bye.